Well, the heat is on this weekend as 90 degree temperatures return. Oh, yeah, they're coming back with a vengeance <laughs> and very little rain in sight. Of course, we do have some drought conditions in the area. Danielle will update us on that. But first, she's in College Grove at our backyard barbecue tonight. All right, I was going to say, Haley and Bob, I have been out here. We have been enjoying ourselves. Now, as the sun is beginning to go down, the temperatures are cooling off. I mean, this pool has been amazing, and uh, I know some folks that want to jump into it, but we're going to wait on that in just a second. First, we've got to get to the weather forecast, though, because the heat is going to be on as we head into this weekend, guys. I want to talk about this. The temperatures are going up. We're going to be around 93 on Saturday, 95 on Sunday. By Monday, we're heating up to 98 degrees, and then 100 on Tuesday. The other other thing is this. It's not just the heat, it's the humidity, the dew point measures the amount of moisture in the air. It's going to be sticky over the weekend in the 60s, but in the mid to upper 60s by Monday and Tuesday. So that leads to uncomfortable conditions, and that means feels like temperatures will be around 100 to 105 in some locations. Uh, I will say this, as you look to the south and west, you see where the warm air is coming from, where temperatures are in the 90s. That's what we're going to tap into as that warm front lifts into us. Locally, most of us are in the 80s. There's a few 90s still on the map, including out west. Uh, in Paris, where we're at 93 degrees. Nashville did hit 92 degrees. So the number of 90 degree days in Nashville, up to 53 days so far this year. The average number per year is 49. So we are a Above average. If you're headed to the Nashville Sounds game tonight, it's going to be warm at least at first pitch, but falling back into the 70s by the end of that game. We also have high school football forecast weather to get to. We'll be at 86 at kickoff, falling back into the 70s by the end of the game. Then this weekend, there's a lot going on. We've got the Wilson County and Tennessee State Fair on Saturday. Now, we'll start in the low 80s, but by afternoon, low 90s, so make sure you're drinking plenty of water if you're taking the kiddos out to the fair. We're back down into the mid 80s. Uh, by 8 o'clock. And then Nashville SC is also in town. Uh, that's at 730. And we are talking about temperatures in the 80s with a wind out of the south at about 5 to 10 miles an hour. So the weekend forecast, we go from the low 90s Saturday, mid 90s on Sunday, and we are warming things up. In fact, Tuesday and Wednesday, it's going to be hot. We're talking about 100 degrees both days, close to record highs. The record Tuesdays, 104. The record Wednesdays, 103. And I will say that the latest 100-degree day we've ever had was September 21st in 2022. The hottest temperature ever was 109, June 29th, 2012. In terms of rainfall, we talked about this. Low-end chances Wednesday, Thursday, but dry before that. And I want to get to that Weather Authority 7-day forecast this weekend, Shelby, because we're going to see those temperatures warm from the mid-90s into the upper 90s on Monday and then the 100s will be returning uh, Tuesday and also into Wednesday with a chance for rain Thursday into Friday. Now I want to come back out live with Taylor and Peter and I got to ask you guys did you have fun tonight? Oh my gosh oh. we had the best time. <laughs> Such a good time thanks for coming out and, and seeing how we enjoy a nice yeah. Friday afternoon in this I, hot weather. I was going to say this is like your housewarming right? This is we doubled it with the housewarming so we were so excited to have all of our friends and their littles and have everybody enjoy it. I was going to say, now, did you guys all come behind me? Oh, yeah. Yeah, okay. I was gonna, now, uh, the food. Okay, got to talk about the food. The food was amazing. That one, What was you. the one food thing again called? White Hots. Zweigel's Hot, hot White Hots, excuse me, from Zweigel's in Rochester, New York. Uh, that was really good, too. I don't know if I showed you that food before. But um, what else do we want to do tonight? There's something else we really want to do, don't we? Yeah, I feel like we should have the kids jump in the pool. I, I, I think that'd be a good idea. I don't know if you see, there's a line of them right here. Yes, yes. Um, and I think they're itching to go. Are you itching to go? All right, All right, let's go, let's kiddos. You're on live TV. Let's go. Jump. <laughs> and that's how you do backyard barbecue. All right, we're going to send it back into you guys. Have a good one.